Kyle, let's go ahead and run through the highlights and show you how Toledo came away with this victory. And with the way Toledo played in the first period, not coming up with a goal, kind of scared you a little bit, didn't it? It did. We, we've seen what happens when a good team has the, the shot department in the lead after the first period, but they stuck with it. They had three shots on the first shift, and they, and they continue to carry the play after that. Yeah, we go into the second period, and Cincinnati would win an early face-off. You know, and they would find the back of the net. You know, the, the thing about that is, I think Weidman got a high stick on, on Hamilton, so it kind of drew Hamilton outside, and then they got the shot through for the big goal, but Toledo responded very well after that. Yeah, here's the first goal of the game for Toledo, and it is Trevor Hamilton. C Cincinnati gave him all the space he wanted. He just took a step to the net, took a shot, and then they, they allowed him to get to, uh, to the rebound, and he got the tying goal. He got to the net again later in the period, and found this one into the back of the net, going off his leg and in. Well, you, you heard him during the interview. He just gets to the net, good things happen. It takes a friendly bounce off him, ends up in the back of the net. And then you, we talked to Coach, frustrating. He's 4-1 four, four to one in the power play department. Uh, but the guys handled the adversity, and they did a great job. And that fourth power play would be a goal from Justin Five. That tied the game at two, early third period. We would carry on in the third. We saw Pat Nagel had to come up with some dynamite stops once again. He did that, especially uh, the way Toledo blocked some shots in front of him certainly helped. And then it would be Brian Moore who would get the eventual game winner. Yep, he capitalized on a bad play by Cincinnati, pinched at the wrong time, uh, kind of got tangled up in his footing, and, and Brian capitalized on an opportunity. That's what good goal scorers do. They, they, they take that opportunity, and he got the game winner tonight. He did. And the congratulations went out because Toledo came up with a victory. Final look at our college advantage stats from this game tonight. Toledo did have the shot advantage, Kyle, 37-27. Another game of that, despite the fact that Cincinnati had two more power plays than Toledo. Yep, that's the that's the thing. P penalty kill for Toledo has been strong this series, and they're sticking together. Big guys are in the box. A.J. Jenks takes the penalty. Guys step up. Guys are answering the bells when they're called upon, and it's, it's leading to this 3-1 series that they have over Cincinnati.